Hello everyone, this is the Anurag aka the German Viking and you might hear some barking in the background, my dog is going berserk. But uh, I wanted to cover multiple articles that um, I, I find really exposes Disney and uh, their agenda along with uh, Marvel. So this is an older article but um, I'm going to combine it with other articles as well. Um, YouTube reportedly mani manipulated Brie Larson's search result for Captain Marvel. Anyone looking up uh, Brie Larson on YouTube may have found that the results might be a little dupli uh, duplicitous. Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce the word. But it's from uh, one angry gamer. Well, well, according to various sources, YouTube has reportedly been modifying and mani manipulating uh, the search results in order to suppress the negative videos, critiquing and criticizing the actress controversial comments she made about white males, leading up to the release of Captain Marvel. It started with a series of tweets from a Twitter-verified user and writer, Julia Alexander, who posted up, uh, up comparison images up before and after shots of YouTube search results for the search term Brie Larson. Alexander made the series of tweets much Seventh, uh, two thousand nineteen. Now you can, you can uh, look at, at the article itself to uh, to to view those tweets. The news spread around the web, but not many many websites seem to have picked up uh, on it. NBC News published an article on March seventh. In 2019, and acknowledging the manipulation on uh, of the search results by YouTube, but the news uh, uh, outlet uh, later deleted the article. Yeah, <laughs> because that goes against the narrative. Including the web cache, an archive only shows four or four page. However, the article didn't completely c uh, clear out of uh, Google's search results. While the article may be deleted from the NBC's uh, news website, there's still a lifted syndicated v v version uh, of the article posted up on the news article's website with a quote of the NBC news article which stated, For Captain Marlboro, uh, for Captain Surprise, YouTube appeared uh, to change its uh, search uh, results for Brie Larson, which moved prob uh, probability to uh, the most assaults on her decrease in choose mainstream media retailers. The corporate in the past introduced that it was once running to spice authoritative information resources. Walt Disney Studios didn't reply for a request for a remark. Yeah, of course they didn't. If you check the results now, it appears as if it's slightly balancing, balancing out. For one instance, you'll see an incorporated uh, video with more than 1 million views is that at the top search alongside Jimmy Kimmel live video. The results aren't consistent though. If you use an incognito video vi window, sorry, the results are almost universally sanitized with the results mirroring the cleaned up uh, manipulated results that appeared uh, in Alexander's image with only corporate news sources appearing at the top, which is interesting. The thing is, there's no uh, way to view a cache of the results before the manipulation. It's not readily possible to compare the results under different conditions. The way back machines also lack the proper archive of the search results, with the only entry in the database being from April 2017. For instance, it isn't being discussed by... Um, much by many outlets or YouTubers. However, Man and Matt did a nine-minute video about the occurrence on the Three Buck Theater channel. It's hard to uh, tell exactly what's happening with the with the results and if it's true that YouTube is purposefully uh, purposefully suppressing negative videos against Larson. However, seeing in Bennett Incorporated's video near the top uh, in all uh, of its cynical uh, glory, along with videos from other critical YouTubers such as the one from Altieri title Why Are People People Mad at Brie Larson? Comic Book Girl 19's What Is Up with the uh, Brie Larson Ca Captain Marvel Controversy and World Class Brutal Shitters uh, How Brie Larson Cost Marvel $100 million. Seems to poke holes in the theory that the results are being tampered with uh, aggressively or consistently. The results uh, definitely seem to favor the co corporate news sources, first from us, but, but running the search handful of times, either in incognito mode or a logged in seems to be give a re relatively similar results, both positive and negative videos. Uh, yeah, so. And uh, combining this article, I'm gonna uh, you can uh, read all of this in um, in uh, the description. But it goes to with the censorship of Rotten Tomatoes, the uh, it also appears that it's being uh, censored in YouTube, and 
we have this ongoing narrative with uh, Disney and um, Marvel. So this is uh, also an, uh, uh, from March 8th. Captain Marvel writer predicts film will inspire women's studies and academic papers. Um, I'm going to use uh, the, the quotes from... Um, from what she's saying, when she, uh, when we see authentic culture reflecting back at us, we realize that heroism is not exclusively the domain of masculinity. And who is saying so? Who is saying that it's just uh, men who can be heroes? This is the feminist uh, mindset. There's nothing inherently masculine about power or sacrifice or the power fantasy uh, or about the sci-fi aesthetic about, or about ethical ideals of these superheroes. When you actually see that you didn't quite let yourself realize you were missing, it is shockingly emotional experience. Have you, ha Has she not seen any of the MCU movies? Apparently not. Was there anything uh, uh, that sort of surprised you or shocked you in either the film process or a final scene that impressed you? There's a scene towards the end. I think there are going to be women's studies and academic papers written about this scene. <laughs> wow. I have a lot of opinions about it. I think it is bold as hell and certainly needed. And there's, a, there's something that's missing from this film that I also think is crazy progressive. But I'm afraid identifying either on one of those things would be a spoiler. <laughs> wow. So, but if we're going to be progressive, can't we actually be truthful about uh, how... Uh, how females are not uh, faster or better as fighter pilots. I'm going to link that uh, article uh, as well. But uh, the headline says, Air Force removes first female uh, Viper demo, t uh, demo team pilot from position after two weeks. So it took two weeks of the fighter pilot. And uh, basically, the, she couldn't lead. And this going on with um, that they want to have a... Uh, a gay character now as well within the uh, Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, I'm gonna um, I use the quote in uh, the article from, from Daily Wire. Oh, Internet, you've done it again. Over the past few days, Marvel fans have been buzzing about the prospect of a gay character to be introduced in the upcoming film The Eternals. The casting would be the first uh, time a gay superhero would appear in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. The continued uh, push for diversity makes sense after the studio's success with Black Panther and the excitement around the upcoming Captain Marvel. But there's only one problem. There's no actual confirmation of the casting news. Yeah, and uh, the, these people are advocating for this um, for this uh, stuff in, in movies. Uh, but I don't care if people are heterosexual or, or gay. But it always feels, if a character is gay, that it's forced and it's basically a token character. I'm going to use an, another quote. Uh, from Daily Wire, um, a number of LGBT-centric publications have picked up the news, but don't go get too excited until an actual gay character has been announced by the comic uh, giant itself. So, this this censorship and this agenda-driven by Disney and, Mo and and all these shells that I'm con gonna continue covering is really what's bugging me. Uh, with uh, with Marvel and Disney because they have a clear agenda and they're not coming out to to uh, counter this they're not saying uh, anything to because it, they know they're gonna get backlash from the minority of uh, people uh, the the SGWs, the the NPCs so again let, let let me know what you think uh, am i totally off uh, of the reservation here or or do i have a point anyways uh, thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time bye